Hello my lovelies, I hope you're all well. There have been some shocking, shocking images coming out of France in the past few days. If you're unaware of what the current situation is, there have been riots, lootings, protests, violence, burning, you name it, it's all been going on in France and it's spilled over into Belgium. So let's break down where this story began. On Tuesday morning, there was a traffic stop. The French police pulled over a 17 year old migrant boy. Um, he then failed to comply with the police and was shot dead at, as a result. Since then, there have been protests and riots and basically what it boils down to is um, as it says here it's a consequence of a failure to integrate the country's Muslim immigrant population. France has taken in uh, hundreds of thousands of immigrants over the past few years. During uh, President Macron's tenure um, immigration has skyrocketed to the point now where France is no longer France. So there have now been over 2,000 arrests made for over this five day period. So the police officer that shot the boy has been arrested. So whether or not it was right what he did, that's for the courts to decide. The 17 year old had a very long rap record. Uh, he was known to the police. Um, the family's lawyer are claiming he had no criminal record, but I believe that the record has been released. So it is public. So we can all see how many dealings he's had with the police. Now, I'm not saying that he deserved what he got. As I said, the courts will decide whether or not the police officer was in the right. President Macron's popularity has plummeted. Um, apparently, he was at an Elton John concert instead of being present when all this started. And he's been blaming social media for the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, sure. It's not the uncontrolled immigration of hundreds of thousands of people who haven't integrated into your country, don't care about your country's culture or anything like that. It's just social media, right? Of course, everyone's blaming racism, saying that the French police are racist and that that was the whole thing behind it. I mean, France can't win, can they? They, they bring in hundreds of thousands of, of immigrants and they're still being accused of racism. But the uh, one of my favourite things to come out of that, to come out of this whole situation, is um, Poland's Prime Minister. He shared a video on his Twitter. I'm going to show you that now. So what are the main differences between Poland and France? France has had uncontrolled immigration. Poland are very careful about who they uh, bring to their country. So the evidence speaks for itself. <laughs> but I'd love to know your thoughts. Let me know and I'll see you very soon.